One of my friends recently saw my computer and saw that I had set up to have two different clocks running on the screen at the same time so they could actually see where they were, where I was relative to their time zone. I was doing a team viewer session with someone and I rolled over this and they said, wait a minute, how'd you get the time zones to show up in other countries? So I thought I would show you this in a video here as well today. If you click on this, you can see that I've got Munich, Germany and Christchurch, New Zealand. But let's say I wanted to change one of these clocks to Delhi, India, or let's say I didn't have either of these clocks on here. Let's say I wanted to go ahead and change the time and date settings. That will bring up a dialog box that looks like this and it shows your local change, your local date and time. You can change that date and time here or you can change your time zone. But you can also set additional clocks. So I have Munich, Germany and Christchurch, New Zealand. It's pretty easy for me to keep track of when the time zone changes in Europe. Just something that I know about but I have a really hard time keeping track of it for my friend in India. And so what I'd like to do is go ahead and change the clock here to make sure that I'm on the right time zone for New Delhi, India, because they're actually on half hour time zones. It's probably a good thing I don't have any friends at the moment in Nepal, otherwise I'd really have to keep track of it because they're on quarter hour time zone difference. But I do work a lot with people in India. And so I'm going to go ahead and change my time zone here and I'm going to call this Delhi, India. You are limited on the number of characters, I think, here to, I think it's 14 characters, but that's enough to describe what actually the time zone is. And I will go ahead and click Apply here and click OK. And you can do this if you don't have it, if you only have one clock running right now, you can use that same tool to show just one other clock. But now when I roll over it, I have an easy reference for what time it is in India. It's basically 11 and a half hours ahead, which is sometimes hard to think about. And then there it, it, and it actually changes when the time zone changes here. It doesn't change at the same time in India. And then I've got my Christchurch time zone there for Christchurch, New Zealand, because I have a friend that lives there as well. And that is how you can show multiple clocks inside of Windows. If you liked this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up below. Be sure to subscribe as we have more helpful videos almost every single day. If you have any questions that we can answer for you, please be sure to come and visit us at showmehowtodothis.com.